Big Boys Neighborhood. I'm Ricky Martinez, backstage at Valentine's Crush with Ciara. Dude, you just killed it on stage. And I'm not talking about like no re like girls that are perfectly not pregnant are still like wishing they could do what you did on Aww. stage just now. That was awesome to see. How, how do you prep for that? You know what? First, thank you very much. <laughs> um, the way I prep for a show like this is I just go in with the spirit of having fun. Right. Because there's but so much moving I can do. Mm -hmm. I can't really dance like I usually do. And so that's a challenge right. for me because sometimes I really want to like start moving some parts of my body. And then I'm like, <laughs> that wasn't a move. Right. Really back in. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I just go with this, the spirit of having fun, honestly. Beautiful. Yeah. Does baby dance to any music? Do you, you know feel what? I have. I've had, um, I put some headphones up to, to my stomach and I played anytime oh. for them. And um, literally kicks started happening like back to back to back to back. Oh. Yeah, it was when oh I was like just recording that song, and so I'm about to start doing more. I do, I read books in my belly, um, which is really fun too. That's so awesome. I'm really into it. I'm really having fun. It's fun to have to. Well, being pregnant for the first time, I'm sure there's aches and pains you never knew you could have in a body. But tell me, what's been the funnest part of being pregnant? The most fun part about being pregnant is just simply not worrying about what I eat. Mm. Like not worrying in the sense of. Um, like before I went on the stage today, I had um, Roscoe's chicken and waffles. Yes. So being able to do stuff like that, yeah. I like and that. It's okay. You know, it's perfect with me. And it's so funny because I, I remember doing the Grammy too. I had like a club cha club sandwich with French fries. And I'm like, this is really, I'm kind of loving this <laughs> life. I'm like not really trying to think about working out right now because right. I know it's going to be really intense. But I'm enjoying that. I'm enjoying that comfort. And um, also just, I think it's the overall experience within itself. It's such, it's like the most beautiful experience a woman could have. Oh, yeah. And so it's just so much fun. Like, and you learn so much about your body. And I'm so in tune with, you know, becoming a mom. Like, I'm having so much fun. Speaking of, I saw you out on the town with Kim K. Uh -huh. Does she give you any tips now that she's a new mommy and just kind of just sharing that you know mommy talk? Let me tell you, she's so funny and so cute. And I'm so proud of her because, it, it, one, it's amazing to see how things happen over time, you know, and how everyone's finding love. And we're getting that. We're, we're, having, we're in such a good place with love right. and with ourselves as women. And, um... She honestly is so cute because I remember going over to her house and um, she was showing me like little, little cool things, you know, that she does that are really good and the standard things for mm -hmm. the baby. And um, we went shopping the other day. We went to go set up something for things that are coming up right. for the baby. And um, it's just really cool. She, she knows what she's doing mm -hmm. and she's growing into it and she's loving motherhood. And it's funny, too, because our stories of pregnancy are different. Like right. she... I didn't like her pregnant her process because it was so oh, hard yeah. for her. We saw that. And then for me, I'm like literally like woo woo woo. <laughs> so you know, it's it's amazing to have cool stories to share. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I'm really proud of her. I yeah. really enjoyed the fact that you came out, or, or just when you when you <laughs> shared the moment that you were pregnant. You took your time. You weren't like, I'm not gonna announce it as soon as I got pregnant. Yeah. What was that moment where you're like, okay, today I'm gonna go on TV. I'm gonna show the world that yes, we are expecting. You know what? It was kind of that thing to where is one. I, most importantly, I got past all the things I needed to for the most part, which is like the test, right? Because that's the most important part. And then physically, I started getting to a place where it was like, you know, you can't really like. It's like y it's going to eventually push through, you know, because you want to keep something like that so special and close to yourself as long as you can. Right. Because uh, for me, it's my first time. I'm running all these different things. Mm -hmm. I don't want to speak too soon. And even when you do share with the world, it's still kind of like a, whoo, because it's like, wow, I, I literally left the view and I was thinking, oh, my gosh, this is like so beautiful. And, but it's so personal. And right. I just shared it with the world. I'm like, whoa. But at the same time, it was the sweetest feeling in the world. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Let's talk future because I, I I see this all the time. When a girl gets pregnant, a lot of the times the dudes get pregnant too. <laughs> has he gotten any any of those pregnancy symptoms? Um, I feel like he has, um, not I feel, but he has caught a <laughs> few of my things, I think. Because um, I've been like pretty smooth selling. Mm -hmm. um, oh. Yeah. I, he, you'd have to ask him mm -hmm. because he could tell you more than I could. Um, but he's been awesome, though, to be honest with you. It's been so much fun because when something like this happens, you know, I can say for myself, it kind of, you kind of get an, e an even stronger bond mm -hmm. with your love. And um, it's been really fun for us. And That's he's been sweet. so supportive, like, there with me every step of the way. And we're having the most fun time together. Already a great daddy. Yeah, he's really yeah. awesome. He's so cute. <laughs> okay, and I did hear you say that you played them music. Oh gosh, it's not multiple. Is that what you're okay. trying to go? You said that. I always say that. That's my clear. generic term. Mm. Yes, because I know I said that and it was like them. Is it more than? Mm. No. And you know what's so crazy is I had all these different ideas of what like maybe what maybe my first pregnancy could be like. Is mm. it something I've always looked forward to? And I was always say if I could have twins, I would love to. But 
There's not two things walking in my baby it's right just now. Just one, and she looks amazing. <laughs> Thank you so much, CR. Thank you. You killed it on stage. Valentine's Crush, Power 106.